All right. Let me show you. Sir, you have a new text message. Oh. Before I uh, start my video, I got a text message. I don't know if you guys heard that on tape. Okay. No big deal. Anyway, I'm going to show you uh, Denise interacting with my home. My first of many home automation uh, videos. I need to buy a little bit more equipment, but I'll show you what I got for now. I'm also going to show you what Denise is like with a very good microphone. I do not get any of the him, him, him issues you have when you use cheaper headsets or microphones with uh, Dragon Naturally Speaking. Obviously, this is not a headset, but uh, it's good enough to where I can use it from my couch, which is you know, six, seven feet away, depending on where I sit. It's a M Audio producer USB. It's a USB mic, obviously. It's not a headset. Um, it's between 80 and 200 bucks, depending on where you get it. This stand did not come with it. I made this myself. Um, uh, in, in radio stations, the studios have these kind of stands to hold the mic, and they're like really surprisingly expensive. So I went to Walmart, and uh, I bought a $20 lamp, and I took off the head and mounted the mic, and it works great. So... Uh, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to get started here. Um, first things first, I'm going to get her to adjust the temperature in my house. That's my nest. It's 75 degrees in here. I'm about, I don't know, maybe about six, seven feet away. Wake up. I can hear you. Adjust the temperature. Turn the temperature up. Turn the temperature down. <sighs> Go to sleep. Entering sleep mode. Say wake up to start recognition. The way she did this was uh, she interacted with um, the Nest homepage, and you can you can do this with your mouse if you want. And I'm I'm using my mouse right now, and I can turn the temperature up or down, and uh, in real time, it'll, it'll uh, adjust the temperature on the Nest. So I got her to um, play with that. <laughs> uh, I got her to do other things as well. I'll show you real quick. Um, wake up. I can hear you. How about some music? Yeah, it's freaking out. Oh, there it goes. I don't know why I did that. Anyway, this is uh, HP connected music. I can make her launch like Spotify or Pandora, whatever. I don't know why it uh, freaked out for a second there, which is kind of strange. It's working flawlessly and go figure I'm making a video and it messes up <laughs> it's cool uh, why does it say the microphone is off let's turn it on go to chat go to chat I feel like writing. Huh. It freaked out again. Opened things it wasn't supposed to. But, I mean, it did open my Windows Live Writer, which is what I use for my blog. Um, really upsets me that I decided to record, and it's messing up a little bit. But, um, but hey, it happens. I'll have to figure that out later. But it, that would, it was just to show you that it does work, you know. Um, you can get Denise to do all sorts of things. Speech recognition is disabled. Click in the red light to turn on. Um, 
Oh yeah, I also got her to uh, interact with my cell phone. I have a program called Remote Phone Call. And it essentially um, links up your smartphone with your PC and you could literally type your text messages on a computer, see who's calling. Uh, and I got her to, um, to work with that. So tell her, wake up. Oops, speech recognition is disabled. I can hear you. Monitor my calls. Yes, sir. I will let you know if you receive any phone calls or text messages. Go to sleep. Entering sleep mode. Say wake up to start recognition. This is the program. It, okay, now it's connecting to my phone. So, yeah. But anyway, I just want to show you a few things. Um, now, keep in mind, I'm using Denise, her internal dragon, and I'm using the standalone 11.5. And I'll prove to you it's 11.5 real quick. Hang on. Wake up. I can hear you. Post to Facebook. Okay. Uh, if that didn't prove it, post to Twitter. Okay. Go to sleep. Entering sleep mode. Say wake up to start recognition. Okay, those are two features in 11.5 Pro, uh, standalone working alongside her internal DNS. Now, uh, if you're still a little confused as to why I'm doing that, it's because you get you get more options. Um, we have been talking about here. Let me disable this real quick. I can hear you. Speech recognition is disabled. Click in the red light to turn on. Okay, this is the um, the CMD browser, is also known as Command Browser. Now, people who only have Denise have the Command Browser. With the Command Browser, you can uh, make Denise do anything you want. Literally, if that task has keyboard shortcuts. For example, if a program I wanted to interact with Denise had keyboard shortcuts, I can use the Command Browser uh, with her to get her to interact with it. The reason why I use the standalone is for this, the macro recorder. Uh, the macro recorder takes it one step further. The, 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 the people who do not have the standalone do not have the macro recorder, which is the whole point why I have it, is you can literally hit record on the macro recorder and do anything, and she will remember everything you did. And then you could stop it, and then you can have it uh, to where she can literally do anything using the macro recorder so if you do have a standalone hit up the forum and uh, there's a certain way you have to install it to get the standalone and the internal dragon to work at the same time and play nice with each other so uh, we'll be happy to show you how so anyway uh, thank you for watching uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel there's more videos coming soon it really helps me out and uh, catch you guys later thanks